Hey everyone, so if you're wondering why I have a band-aid on my hand, um, yeah, I am always hurt. It's just kind of inevitable. I don't know why, but I am, in fact, wearing a Hello Kitty band-aid right now. And let me tell you why you should keep Hello Kitty band-aids handy. Um, if you are happening to maybe, I don't know, try and shrink your tripod just one level back up, don't get your skin caught in the, um, tripod. Or else you will bleed. Basically, I'm wearing a Hello Kitty band-aid right now. I guess I could just call it 50 things you might not know about me, although if you know me, then you probably know these things. So, let's get started. I am five foot eight and a half. Fun fact, I'm actually the second to shortest person in my family besides my little brother, who is slowly but surely catching up with me. I am a volleyball player. I actually play middle front. I have traveled out of the country to a bunch of different places like Mexico, the Bahamas, China, which I will relate to another fact. But yes, I have traveled to Taiwan as well. That's all that I can think of right now. I always have my nails painted. You will never, well I probably never say never, but you will 99.9 .9 times out of 100 probably see me with my nails painted because I really don't like it when my nails aren't painted. I look really gross without them and I feel naked. If you're wondering what I'm looking down at, it's my notes on my phone. I have an obsession with brownies and Oreos, but um, yeah, it's just weird. If you give me those, I will love you forever. Other than those, I never eat sweets unless there's probably something wrong with me if you see me eating candy, like, I hardly ever eat candy. My favorite drink is sweet tea. At school, I always get a sweet tea for lunch. And at home, I have a cup full of sweet tea, which is either a Ninja Turtle cup, you know those plastic cups. I'm either drinking out of sweet tea, out of a Ninja Turtle cup, or a Despicable Me cup. My shoe size is eight and a half, which is pretty small for my height. Like I mentioned earlier, it's really weird that I, I kind of have small feet, and I can't sh I can't share shoes with my mom or my sister. I've only broken one bone, which is my pinky toe. Yes, I did break my pinky toe, and it was actually like if this is all your toes, and then your pinky toe is like that. Like that's what happened to my pinky toe. I'm probably the most unhealthy person in my family because they eat like fish and things like that and I don't eat fruit. I have actually scuba dived with sharks before and it's extremely terrifying. I don't know if I would ever do it again. I probably would, but it, I get terrified. I have met Justin Bieber. I went to his meet and greet in Minneapolis. so. That was pretty exciting, and it was really fun. I, like I mentioned earlier, I don't eat any seafood. Like, I haven't eaten it since I was a kid. Can't eat it, don't eat it, won't eat it. When I was little, I did, in fact, have an imaginary friend named Hello Kitty, and we actually, this is kind of weird, we didn't, even, we didn't like each other. <laughs> so I hear from my family, and I do remember saying that she hit me, then I cried. I am a crazy reader. I read like all the time. I probably go to go through like three books a week. My favorite movie is The Last Song with Liam Hemsworth and Miley Cyrus. If you know me, you probably know that. I watch that movie all the time because it never gets old. I just love it. I have also met Gabrielle Union who used to be my idol as a child. I absolutely love her. And she, if you don't know who she is, then you should probably Google her. She's dating Dwayne Wade. She is also the head cheerleader in Bring It On. I am actually a Christian. I'm actually a non-denominational Christian. 
Which is funny because non-denominational is actually a denomination. Kind of. I have one older sister and one younger brother, so I am a middle child. I took swimming lessons as a kid, which I actually hated. So, yeah. I did not like swimming lessons at all. And I basically, like, they made me go to the deep end and I almost drowned. So I hated it. And I stopped going. I'm probably going to beat Michael Phelps. <laughs> I've walked the Great Wall of China. And I... Is it in... Shanghai or Beijing? Yeah. Wherever it is, I walked it. Not the whole thing, but there's a sec because they closed it at off, but the section that you can walk, I walked. I took ballet and tap as a kid and I was actually pretty good at it. I had two I I remember two recitals. One I was dressed up as Minnie Mouse and the other one I was wearing like something blue, like a blue leotard or something like that. But I stopped once I stopped taking, taking ballet and tap because I took hip hop and I didn't like it. My middle school class in 7th grade had 9 people in it. But I am, I am an awkward person when you first meet me. I'm really, really awkward. So, yeah. That's two facts in one. Bonus. I'm half Asian and half white, which I believe I've mentioned in a video before. So, yeah. I do make all A's in school. I do, my grandma actually has a ranch which she lives on right now and at one point that ranch had like 100 kittens and I was obsessed with them. And I named one like Snowball or something like that. When I was little, I pretty much wanted to be two things, a doctor or a marine biologist and those, that was pretty much all I wanted to be as a kid. Revolving rides and rides that have too many loops make me really, really dizzy and really, really nauseous. But I can do loopy roller coasters and not get super, super sick. But if it's just a ride that goes straight in circles, I can't do it. I have to be eating something constantly or I get a really bad headache and I get really cranky. Relating back to the China facts, I people in China about three people stopped to me to ask me to take pictures with me and at that time I it, I don't think it was because of YouTube because I didn't have I have like I don't even think I made videos but I don't really know why they just wanted to take pictures with me and they were really excited to take pictures with me it was a young girl and a couple but they both took individual pictures with me so Three people in China have pictures of me somewhere. My makeup collection is insanely ridiculous because I started collecting in like 7th grade and I continue to buy makeup because I'm addicted. I've been to over 12 states in the US. It's probably more than 12. Actually I know for a fact that it's 13. Probably more than that. But I couldn't count it because I didn't have a map. Probably have a map somewhere but I'm too lazy. I was in a car accident in 2nd grade. But nobody in the car was actually like critically harmed or anything like that. But the car did um, turn upside down and slide upside down. Since fourth grade, I started to grow out my hair. And I've had long hair since. It might have been third grade, but it was about right there. Third grade, so I don't really... I mean, it's kind of like medium. But yeah, I started to grow out my hair from then on. My style isn't really one particular thing. I'm not super girly and I'm not super like grungy obviously but um, I can wear like combat things and then I can be really girly or really like bohemian or beachy. It just depends on what I'm feeling and what I have in my closet that's clean. I absolutely hate scary movies. You couldn't get me to watch a scary movie if you gave me a million dollars. My favorite ice cream is Cookies and cream slash chocolate chip cookie dough. I have shot a gun before, though I sucked at it and I didn't hit anything that I tried to aim at. I had braces for three years of my life. My best friend and I at school actually talk in Asian accents to each other all day. Every day. And it's not like to make fun of it. I think that it's just a habit that we do and we just, we like talking like that. My kind of like god sister, she's actually like a second sister to me, 
is actually the third generation of best friend sister like figures. It's me and her, my mom and her mom, and my grandma and her grandma. Hopefully our kids will continue generation. In my family, I always just like make up random sayings and then my whole family, my immediate family like starts saying it. Like, um, I don't know, I just say things in a voice or say things in general and then my family, like my brother and my sister will start saying it. I have played piano and guitar, though I'm more experienced in guitar than I am in piano. I do know how to storm snowboard and ski. I've done both, though I only did skiing for about three years maybe because I used to go to Colorado every spring break and I was I did snowboarding the rest of the time. But this year was the first year that I did not go um, to snowboard. I have ziplined over a mountain in I think California. So I've ziplined about two or three times and it's really fun and exciting and if you have the opportunity to do it, you definitely should. I've never read the Harry Potter books. Now, I actually said this today at school and one of my friends like freaked out that I hadn't read them. Though the ride at Universal Studios was really exciting. Not the dragon challenge, though that one was exciting, but the other one. I'm obsessed with owls and sea turtles, though my obsession with owls has kind of died down. I don't really love them anymore but I still love sea turtles and I wore my necklace today just to remind you guys or not remind you but like show you that I do and it's right here if you can see it it's just a little sea turtle coming out of his little egg and then he has a little diamond right there and my sister actually got this for me when she went to Hawaii my favorite color is blue and my entire room is like this room, but this part of the wall is like a light blue, and then this part is a dark blue. So I'm wearing purple today. Awkward. I have lived in the same house since second grade. I have attended Lady Gaga and Britney Spears concerts, which were both insane. But my by far favorite concert was... Hannah Montana and the Cheetah Girls. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I, yeah. I went to those when I was little. Those are all my 50 facts. It was probably more than 50 because I gave you some details that were probably considered facts. But I hope that you guys enjoyed this video and learned something new about me. Because I would hope out of 50 facts, at least one of them was new information. And yeah. That was all of my things that I had to tell you. Bye. And you don't have band-aids handy, then you're out of luck. So, yeah. Well, I guess it's not the palm, but, like, on the actual part that you use to touch things. Okay. We make YouTube videos. Maybe you do.